Today we meet Dina Bina, a successful Tanzanian businesswoman with a mission to make sure everyone around her profits from her flower shop. She started from scratch in 1996. And the first day when I came with my five bunches of flowers, of course my first customer didn't see the five bunches of flowers. He saw the little container of water that I had for myself and asked if I'm selling water. And as an entrepreneur, you don't pass any chances. So I told him I'm, I'm also selling water and he said, okay, can I have a glass? Then the challenge was how much is a glass of water? I thought quickly and said, okay, it's 20 cents. But I had to be careful, you don't want to overprice. Because the next day my customers won't come because I'm, I'm very expensive. So I said, okay, it's 20 cents, but if that is not enough for you, I'll give you a bonus, an extra glass. So he took it and he was glad with one glass and paid 20 cents and that was my first income. People didn't see that I have flowers and I decided, okay, I'll sell it to the boys. There was a lot of boys that were street vendors. I gave them the bunches they sold and they gave me some income and I gave them commission. Now it's 13 years later. Dina's shop is still on the same spot, but now slightly bigger. And she sells to a variety of clients. Where it has grown, I, I, I sell to 40 different clients. As you can see in the shop, they're busy preparing flowers for the offices. Uh, I'm preparing some for clients for the trade fair, a big international trade fair. I have um, hotels that I sell flowers to. And I, could, I should say really from that one glass of water, I'm not where I am. I haven't reached where I want to go, but I have grown. Many of Dina Flower's clients are long-term customers. According to Dina, a personal approach and understanding of the customer is essential. Like this young man who's buying flowers for his fiance. Dina shows him which flowers to give her. Actually, when you are doing a certain field of work, you should go out of your way and do something extra. They, they, they might know, but just that extra touch. I'm a mother, and um, a lot of these young people who come here, maybe they are age of, of my sons, and I like them to do the right thing. So for this particular one who was just walking in, I wanted him to know exactly how to present it. Just an addition is customer care. Make it a bit light, some light moments when you're doing sales. You don't just grab the money and tell them, okay, have a good time. I hope you'll reach there and come tomorrow. Tina Bina takes us for a walk in the surroundings of her shop. This is the domain of many street vendors. They also sell flowers. But Dina refuses to see them as competition. Yeah, these are, are entrepreneurs. They're my neighbors. <laughs> <laughs> so they brought they brought the some 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 baskets from Dodoma. This is where the parliament normally sits in the central almost center of Tanzania. And this is beautiful. I mean I've just seen them now. So what I'm trying to tell them is what is the wholesale price? I can design something and put it in these baskets and they can get money, I get money. And that's how I normally work. 